Hi guys, I'm back again today with another reaction video and today we're checking out uh, an Ahmed Didat video. It's been a while, I know, but there's not many videos there for us to check out by him because we've almost reacted to everything, not necessarily, but I don't know. Please recommend. Well, before we start, don't forget to subscribe, click the bell button and let's get it. Oh, this is Ahmed Didat's 40 year open challenge to christianity so let's hear what it is maybe until this day it's still un um i found your lecture very informative and at times entertaining very interesting to listen to what i found very sad i am a born again christian what i found very sad was that in 40 years and correct me if i'm wrong but i believe you did say that in 40 years You've never met a Christian who has been able to come to the front and tell you what the Holy Spirit's done for him. Is that correct? I said it. Go ahead. I, I think I said that in 40 years that I'm doing this work, nobody has brought forth one, one new thing that any church, including the born again, you have to come and tell me that this Holy Ghost came and told you solution to these problems. Where? Which church he came to? When did he come to you? To give you answers for the rest of Christendom that now alcohol, what you do about alcoholism, what you do about gambling, what you do about surplus women, what you do about racism. I want to know what the Holy Ghost told anybody. In 40 years I'm asking, nobody has come out with one new truth which the Holy Ghost gave to any church at any time. One new truth. If you have it, let's hear. Well, sure. yes. well I should be aware that you're a reasonable man and a deep thinking man. God is interested in men and women. And God is interested in my life. And since the Holy Spirit came into my life, when I became a born again Christian, He's helped me make decisions concerning my money. He's helped me make He's helped me to love my I feel like that is fate though. It's not necessarily like a spirit coming to you and say, hey, you know what? This is how you do life. This is what you do. It, it's not necessarily like a spirit is like, hey, Rookie, do this. Or I don't know how a spirit would sound. Or, hey, Rookie, or, ah, I don't know. Um, it's not necessarily that, right? It's just you as a person who has that fate. That's like, oh, you know what? I want to do good. I want to be a good human being because I don't want to go to hell. And I just want to live like a good human being, right? It's not necessarily... Oh, well, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he literally saw, right? And it was told. But here. He's helped me make decisions concerning my money. He's helped me, make, he's helped me to love my wife. Individually, any system. See, there are people looking for a way out. Christians are looking for a way out. Some find it in Hinduism. Some join the Hare Krishna movement. Some join the devil worshipping cult. Look, you find somewhere along the line, the guy gets caught out, he becomes a Jehovah's Witness. He says he found it. He becomes a Seventh-day Adventist, he found it. Some become born again, he says he found it. The experience this is talking about is something subjective. In other words, internet again it's a human or is it part of the video actually any system see there are people looking for a way out christians are looking for a way out some find it in hinduism some join the Hare krishna movement some join the devil worshiping cult you find somewhere along the line the guy gets caught out he becomes a jehovah's witness and so he found it he becomes a seven day adventist he found it some become born again this is he found it the experience this is talking about okay, is something subjective in other words human being anybody you're looking for a way out his wife and him must have had quarrels endless quarrels maybe he was imbibing too much alcohol all these were problems there he was looking for a way out and somebody came along with a little charisma and said look my son allow christ to come into your life i say it works it does work there's no doubt about that but Hare krishna movement also works islam also works buddhism also works you are a drowning man clutching at straws somewhere along the line some little help and you have saved yourself but the question still remains look you haven't answered the question 40 years not a single 
Christian in the world of any church or denomination has come forward to say that the Holy Ghost gave my church this solution. The Anglicans, the Roman Catholics, the Presbyterians, the Lutherans come as any church that says we heard the Holy Ghost came and told us how to solve the problem of surplus women, how to solve the problem of alcohol, how to solve the problem of racism. Look, these are individual experiences which everybody is going through at all times. I'm not doubting you, my son. What you said, I believe that your life... Oh, okay, so what Ahmed Dila is trying to say is, yeah, okay, yes, God will give us answers in our problems, no doubt about that. But why hasn't he, the, the Holy Ghost, given us the solution to bigger problems like racism and you know the examples he gave right why is he just providing you answer to your problem but isn't giving the churches a larger solution to a larger problem and also like at all times i'm not doubting you my son what you said i believe that your life could be changed but this does not change 60 million britishers it won't change 250 million americans you need a way of life, direct instructions, which each and everybody can understand in a clear-cut language. And this book gives it to you. Oh, so this is from John, right? But when he, the spirit of truth, comes, he will guide you into all the truth. He will not speak on his own. He will speak only what he hears and he will tell you what is yet to come. Well, that sounds familiar. If you know, you know. getting into the problem of alcoholism gambling well in Christianity this is also like um it's a no-no actually but obviously yeah, Ah, uh, okay, so this is the editor giving us the problems and how the Quran is solving it, right? Um, like I was saying a while ago, alcoholism and gambling is not allowed also in at least born again us or pentecostal but i don't know the rest of the other sects of christianity i'm not versed because i've never attended like those others or studied um yeah it's not allowed also but some still do it of course um i don't know why <laughs> but anyways let's go to the problem of racism I think this is the prayer, right? So, like everybody comes together at the masjid. Yeah.
was it? Well, I don't know if the gentleman who asked the question a while ago still spoke afterwards because I would have liked to hear what he had to say after Ahmed did that said what he said. Well, let me know down in the comments and if you like this video and if you have more recommendations, let me know down in the comments or buy me coffee for me to uh, be able to get to it uh, like faster because it will be sent to my email that hoy rookie hoy <laughs> yes <laughs> my email is like hoy my uh, yeah uh it will be sent to my email directly if uh you buy a coffee but if it is like in a comment it might drown not literally but you know i it might not get a notification to see it and all that stuff but anyways if you like the video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe i'll see you guys in the next video bye